You like Fenty Soft Matte. You're gonna love this. Wow. Okay, first of all, I think this is... This might be the start of a new civil rights movement. And I'm not saying it's be funny. Hey guys, Nancy here. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. So today I have a fun video. Uh, Physicians Formula was nice enough to hook your girl up with the starting lineups of their butter collection as well as their diamond collection and a few of their organic wear items. And this is the result. This look was brought to you by Physicians Formula. Not only did they send me the product, it's Physicians Formula. Like, can we just talk about the fact that this is a big brand all up in my emails? <laughs> Physicians Formula. Visit Physician's formula, physician's formula. I, I feel like I need to write a letter to every drugstore near me that does not carry the range of products because clearly physician's formula has the range. Physician's formula did this, drugstore did this. And to be quite honest, I'm shook. So if you wanna get into this tutorial, just be sure to scroll down, hit that subscribe button, join the Nat G gang, 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 and let's get into this video. Welcome, welcome, let's get into business. You guys. Something amazing happened, as you probably see by the title of this video and my introduction. Your girl's on a piano. I'm gonna get the box of goodies. We're gonna jump into it. I'm, as you guys know, I already get a lot of support from smaller businesses, smaller black-owned businesses, which I obviously appreciate. But this is like a milestone in like my career as like an influencer, aka a YouTuber. Like this is like. This is huge <laughs> and I have to, you know, to my own horn, I have to make up myself and celebrate everything just because without you guys and without this channel and without every, like, without every single like, subscribe, everything, encouragement, everything, it would not have happened. So it means so much. So let's just keep the same energy throughout the rest of 2021 and 2022, please. <sighs> I still have like packaging. I haven't like officially opened anything. Look, look at this, look at this. Look at this! They gave me so much stuff. I'm so excited to dive in. I don't even know where to start, but I feel like the best way is to start by doing my makeup. And then as we get to new products or products that they give me options to use, we talk about it, get into it. So the first product I'm going to use is their putty primer. So it claims to be a bouncy, silky, lightweight primer that smooths and preps skin for long lasting makeup wear. So this is the packaging and this is what it looks like. I just dip my knuckle in there. Oh yeah, you know, oh, it smells good. What is that, like coconut? Um, It's very much so giving, do you remember Maybelline Baby Skin Primer? It's that in a jar and with a really, really pretty scent. But she smells like you want to forward to the islands, baby. Yeah, it's, it's like, it's feeling like a pore filler for sure. Get into it, yeah, oh my gosh. No, if I could tell you guys how this smells, wow. I don't even know how to describe what it feels like. My skin feels like velvet. I got their organic wear foundation as well as their Butter Believe It foundation. I'm going to swatch both, but today I really want to wear the Butter Believe It foundation because I want to do something really full coverage. So again, this is the organic wear. That's a really good match. Look at my neck. Sorry, I'm wearing a total neck just to be dramatic, but I mean, that's not, that's like really your skin, but better. That's giving, I'm impressed. You know what it's like? If you like um, Fenty Soft Matte, you like Fenty Soft Matte. You're gonna love this. Wow. Okay, first of all, I think this is, this might be the start of a new civil rights movement. And I'm not saying it to be funny. I'm saying it to the fact that this is annoying that a brand like this has so many good products. I'm already annoyed at the fact that the primer and this foundation look so good on my skin and I can never get it at my local drugstore because they refuse to buy for black women. But the brand has clearly the range, like I'm already mad. But thank you Physicians Formula again for sending this to me because like I'm shook at how nice this feels and I'm upset that I don't get to just go pick this up at my drugstore. So you guys are gonna have to keep sending me stuff basically. <laughs> Let's get into the Butter Believe It concealer and foundation because child, I'm already mad. So I feel like this one is a little bit darker than I'd like it to be, but not too bad. Like it's not too far off. It is full coverage. Like I don't think you need to build this up. So as you can see, I concealed my face. That's just because I did not get a concealer from them. And I want this video to really be about Physicians Formula. Next, we're gonna get into powders. I have two powders from them. I have this Matte Manoi bronzer. 
that I received, which as you can tell by my complexion and this bronzer, it is probably not gonna be a bronzer on me. I'm probably going to use it to set like my lighter areas. I'm gonna see how that goes. If not, I'll just use another product then we'll move on. But they sent me this one first. And then once I told them my shade, they sent me this version of the butter bronzer. The shade is Endless Summer. This packaging doesn't match the rest of the line, which makes me believe it's probably maybe like an older version or it's just not a part of this new launch. Maybe this is a different formula. But yeah, I'm used to seeing this one. I feel like I've seen this one before. So I'm going to open these up. She's definitely giving highlight powder, so. So that's how we're gonna use her. And this one, I could probably get away with. Look at that, it's called being innovative. That's literally what makeup's about. I use things wherever they serve me. No stress, no drama. And it smells good, it smells like vanilla pudding. Like, from my childhood, vanilla pudding. I like this. I'm gonna clip my hair again, I don't know who I thought I was. Oh yeah, like, look at me bronzing with physician formula. <laughs> I don't understand like how many people have ever felt personally victimized by the drugstore not selling your shade in something. Okay. This is giving Dare I Say Flawless. Okay. I wanna try out this Dewy Blush Elixir. This is in the shade, and it has super fruits in it. This is in the shade Crushed Berries. I'm gonna pump it on the back of my hand because I don't know what it looks like. Ooh, that's sexual. That is sexual. It's a very, very sexual pink. Go in with it on my cheeks. I just wanted to be sure, you know? I have two highlighters. I have the Diamond Dust highlighter as well as, well, as, well as the butter highlighter. So I'm going to try and use both. So in their butter highlighter, this is a cream to powder formula and it is in the shade Deep Mauve, which is stunning looking. Oh, that's sexual. First of all, no, the way that that feels, so soft. You love a natural glow. You feel very natural, like natural, but like caked up, like <laughs> double caked up on a Tuesday. Now I'm going to use the Diamond Dust, which is more like a glass-like complexion, and this feels exactly like Fenty's like Diamond Bomb, to be quite honest, exactly what it reminded me of. And it's supposed to melt right into the skin, and it's very iridescent. I'm just gonna layer it right on top. I live, I live. I feel like I'm so, like I look like the Tin Man, because I just put so much highlighter. Now I'm gonna set my face with the Butter Believe It Skin Mist. Mm. And it has the coconut smell. Now we're gonna get into the full blown butter mascara and the butter eyeliner. So I'm just gonna do these really quickly and pop on some lashes. So this eyeliner is a brush tip if you like brush tip eyeliners. And it's supposed to be waterproof and long lasting. That was actually really easy to use. I was afraid when I saw the brush tip, but we here. So the butter blow up mascara, not only does it have the butters that the entire line has, but it also has keratin, which is supposed to be super good for your like hair, it's like on your body. And this is what the wand looks like. Honestly, this brush is perfect for body lashes. I don't have any clumps, no spider lashes. And then lastly, I have the two diamond plumpers, which are basically plumping lip glosses. I have the shades Pink Radiant Cut and a Light Pink Princess Cut. And I'm going to definitely put on a lipstick and line my lips after this, but I just want to swatch these for you. So look at Light Pink giving Iridescent Angel and pink radiant on me is just like a very very subtle pink but but either way you're getting like a thick nice juicy gloss with lip pumping in it but i just wanted you guys to see like she juicy so i'm gonna line my lips i'm also gonna put on some lashes just because you guys know i live for the drama and then i'm gonna come back with my final thoughts <laughs> okay so this is the finished look officially honestly i think it'd be easier for me to say the products i like the least because there's only really one and it's the blush and it's not because it's the blush's fault it's more so because i shouldn't have put it in this look because i feel like especially with their blinding highlighters i'm just overall looking just a little greasy right here but that's it it's just that i used it incorrectly today it's not that i don't like it it's just not my favorite i usually stay away from cream products anyways when it comes to my face i like to set things um so that was really the only thing that was kind of concerning to me, but like even like looking at my face, I'm like, this is physician's formula. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did like it, please give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below if you have any questions, comments, or concerns about anything I did today. Leave that in the comments down below. And as always, subscribe to me. You pay my bills, right? Again, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one.